World Tennis with Harry Chickma is brought to you by the Bud Collins History of Tennis, compiled by Bud Collins, tennis historian, journalist, and Hall of Famer. Also presented by The Education of a Tennis Player, the newly updated and re-released memoir of Rod Laver, the only man to win the Grand Slam of Tennis twice, available now in bookstores and on Amazon.com. Morfit Performance, the best performance apparel tested by trainers and made for serious athletes. Stay dry and odor free in Morfit and visit MorfitPerformance.com. Here in New York City with Tony Traber, a Tennis Hall of Famer, and a lot of great things happening with the Hall of Fame. You're announcing your enshrinement class here at uh, Tennis Night in America. Exactly. Tonight in Madison Square Garden, we'll make the announcement, which uh, will get to a lot of tennis fans. Uh, we're, we're looking forward to it. And a lot of uh, great enshrinees this year, inductees. I mean, Gigi Fernandez, you have double teams, uh, wheelchair tennis for the first time. Right. I'm, I'm excited about the wheelchair tennis because uh, uh, other than getting the, the ball on two bounces, they play exactly like everybody else plays. And, and they've done a marvelous job. And so um, Brad Parks will be our first inductee, and, and uh, we'll have other wheelchair inductees as, as we go along, not necessarily every year. But uh, I'm excited about that. Um, and, you know, the Woodies, uh, the Australians, uh, have been a fabulous uh, team. And Zareva and, and Fernandez, as you mentioned. Owen Davidson, Grand Slam of Mixed Doubles. And Derek Hardwick, who was instrumental in helping us get open tennis, which is so important for our sport. And also looking forward to uh, July Tennis Week, you know, a great time of the year, the Campbell's event. Uh, what are you looking forward to with that? Well, it, you know, it's the only grass court event in North America. That's the week after Wimbledon. Mark Stenning, our CEO, does a great job of organizing and running that event. And uh, our induction ceremony, ceremony is on that Saturday, July 10th. And uh, it's always an exciting time. And, and uh you, you see how excited the players are, how emotional they are, and what it means to them to be inducted into the International Tennis Hall of Fame. And no better place to be in the world. Newport in the summer. I mean, the grass courts, I believe right. the only public grass courts in North America. Yes, it is. Uh, and it's the only public the grass court tournament in North America. So uh, it's, it's a great event, and, and, and the, the people who come watch it really enjoy it. And the men's tour right now, talk about the world of tennis. Uh, what do you think? Uh, Nadal's kind of injured. Federer's still on top. Yeah, Federer's still the best player. And Nadal, I'm afraid his injuries may shorten his career. I hope not because uh, he has a great rivalry with Federer. And they're both wonderful human beings, which is great for our sport. And um, I just hope that he, he's healthy enough to play. But they got a lot of depth on, in, in the men's tour. And it's, it's fun to watch. Uh, they, they really are good players. And the women are looking good as well. I mean, we have some uh, old champions coming back. Kim Kleisters, Justine Anna. Yeah, that help, that's helped the women's game a lot. And if uh, Serena can stay healthy, and uh, Venus, of course, is a, is a wonderful player. And they have some other depth, too. Their top 10 or 12 are very, very good. So they've improved themselves and, and, and uh, done a good job. And I'd say all in all, uh, pro tennis is very healthy right now. Well, Tony Trebute, thank you very much for joining us here, and thank you for everything with the Hall of Fame. My pleasure. Thank you. AceAuthentic.com, the world's largest tennis memorabilia and tennis trading card company, now offering a French Open exclusive discount of 20% off any purchase made at AceAuthentic.com, the only place for all your tennis collectible needs. AceAuthentic.com.